What is up, guys? So, today we're getting into the heart here. The heart of the matter. Or something like that. I don't know. Heart tools. So, you know, this, this tool company kind of... I've only known them from hammers and maybe... Um, you know, pry bars at Home Depot. And here they rolled out uh, cordless tools and hand tools at Walmart. Um, in a big lineup too. Like I was, I was blown away that how much stuff they offered right off the hop here, releasing there at the Walmart. I know I'm a little bit behind on the times. This kit was uh, nine ninety four dollars. Uh, I don't know with tax it was a hair over a hundred Looking at the box here. We got two batteries included both 1.5 amp hour lithium-ion uh, You got a drill driver and they say powerful motor with up to 1600 ripples and impact driver high-speed fastening with up to 1700 inch pounds of torque so you got the all-in-one battery system 20 volt system garage lifestyle yard workshop you know <laughs> so and it does say on the front limited three-year warranty let's open this up take a gander what's inside I, I kind of like how this is packaged because you go to Walmart and uh, I don't know, maybe you take your kids every once in a while, once a year, and get them a toy. It's kind of boxed the same with the see through. You can touch and feel. That's interesting concept, you know. I don't know if you you know you've seen it or whatever. Pretty interesting co concept. It's not you know because Walmart's not Home Depot. How do you get people to keep the tools safe from walking out and people can still touch and put their hands on there and whatnot? Neat idea, something I noticed. You know? And alright, let's get this over here. We're flopping everywhere. Alright, let's see. Time. Now, my gosh, that is, uh, that is a, uh, it's a big drill, a little front heavy. As you can see, it's got about a 20 foot chuck clutch on it and the uh the impact uh that's not metal I, I don't think that's metal it sounds like it's looks like plastic yeah it's plastic plastic front there um kind of an old old chuck Alright, well, let me dig in the rest of the box here. And see what we got. What we got going on. Definitely going to have a little tool battle. Start throwing this into my rotation because I, you know. Obviously, these are DIYer. Yeah, we got instruction manuals. Um, now, a guy like me, I could probably get away using them professionally because, yeah, I did with Ryobi, I did with Rigid, I 
I do with Milwaukee. So, we get some bits there. Well, not very good. Let's see if they're even labeled heart. You know. Nope. PH2. PH2 in a flathead. It's kind of weird. Um, Alright, so we got batteries. And the batteries are plain Jane. There you go. They are lithium ion. And this would be the charger. Who'd they get that idea off of? Uh, Black and Decker. Jeez. Jeez. Alright. So let's see if it gives us any lights. It's got a little red light at the. Uh, it was red. So it's charging. So at least it gives you an indicator and now stays solid green whenever it's done charging. Now, just for fun, there's the arrangements on those in there. Alright, man that is a chunky impact. 3200 impacts per minute model number HPID 01 the big heart on the back so it's kind of nice that the back has you know rubber on it seems like if you dropped it absorb that impact um, you know a lot of old timers I kind of prefer the bulkier tools from just what I've seen, you know, in the trades. This actually feels pretty good going back and forth. It's got a little LED at the, the foot of the, the base there. Brushed and let's just do a uh, little side by side comparison now. I don't know how long ago this was that I got this, but that's the Ryobi, my old one. Let's see. Yeah, at some sort of metal up there. It's nice to see on the old Ryobi. I understand this battery's not charged, but that is what it is there. So we'll keep rolling along with this all. Moving on to the drill. Man, I am just I'm surprised of the size of this drill. I really am. If I can find my. Let's see, where is it? I guess we'll just have to use the bigger battery. So, again, going back with. I mean, it's. It's darn near the same. That's, that's an old Ryobi. I mean the, the the length and I understand it's the first shot at them and they're just coming out but I you know Ryobi batteries makes me wonder why you jump into this hold on ah. when there's so many brands out there this thing takes two hands to move back and forth See what this champ sounds like here. I 
I mean, absolutely nothing special. Okay, a few things I do like is I don't mind the trigger. I don't mind the directional switch. Uh, this the overall size of these is just ginormous. Um, the the specs, you know, they're not they're not bad for a homeowner. Probably do more than you know you need them to. Um, I don't know. Uh, there's so many options out there. It's hard for me to say. Yeah, go ahead and jump in on this one. Um, I applaud them for coming out and making these tools how they did. And running out a lineup. I uh, hope, you know, may they tweak it and adjust it. Or may this is a one-time run. You never know. You never know with Wally World. Or Heart Tools or whoever owns them. I don't know. Um, I, th I think someone says TTI that owns Heart. Uh, anyways, though, that's my initial impressions of heart tools, and, uh, I would understand why you wouldn't jump into this lineup, but it is there, and, uh, you know, I'll use it, I'll test it out, I'll see how it does, At the end of the day, you know, how it performs and stuff, that's all that really matters, so if it works for someone, it works for someone, I'm not going to bash someone for using them. Just keep in mind there's a lot of options out there. Anyways, guys, have a great night. Catch you on the next one.